As you may recall, Jada Pinkett Smith recently decided to let her hair go by shaving her whole head. Taking to Instagram, Jada said that her daughter Willow Smith convinced her, writing, Willow made me do it because it was time to let go, but my 50s are about to be divinely lit with this shed. Though inspired by Willow, Jada likely also shaved her head due to her past issues with hair loss. In a 2018 episode of Red Table Talk, Jada opened up about her alopecia experience, saying, A lot of people have been asking about why I've been wearing turbans. Well, I haven't talked about it. It's not easy to talk about, but I am going to talk about it. As she explained, Jada first began losing hair while in the shower. It was one of those times in my life where I was literally shaking with fear. So, in order to mask the loss of hair, Jada began wearing turbans. Meanwhile, Willow spontaneously shaved all of her hair back in 2012 when she was only 11 years old. Why do it if you're not gonna have fun? Will Smith told E! News in 2017, We came downstairs and she had shaved her head bald. I was like, Oh, wow. What was his reaction to seeing Jada bald, though? Well, on the September 15th episode of Red Table Talk, Jada Pinkett Smith sat down with guest Tiffany Haddish, alongside daughter Willow Smith and mother Adrian Banfield Norris for a conversation. At some point during their chat, Haddish asked Jada about Will Smith's reaction to her shaving her hair. Jada said, quote, He loves it. Willow also shared that, at the time, she received a text from her father saying how Jada looks, quote, stunning. Later in the episode, Jada further discussed saying goodbye to her hair. The actor admitted, It was just time. I was just ready for that kind of expression and release. I'm so glad I did it. It was such a beautiful experience and such a freedom. Jada also said that she now feels, quote, more connected with herself and to the great divine. Jada went on to add that the experience taught her to simply stop caring what people think. Haddish, who shaved off her hair in the summer of 2020, shared similar sentiments as the host. Haddish said on Red Table Talk, During the beginning of the pandemic, I was reading the Bible more, checking up on the Torah and everything. Everything is talking about know thyself, know thyself. And that just kept resonating with me. I'm like, okay, when I hear things, I take it literal. Jada Pinkett Smith and Willow Smith aren't the only ones in the family to have shaved their hair. A few years ago, Jaden Smith cut off his dreadlocks for a movie role, with some help from his dad Will Smith. Taking to Facebook, Will shared a few pictures of the aftermath. To accompany the pictures, Will wrote on Facebook in April 2017, getting Jaden Smith ready for the first day of filming, Life in a Year. Maybe I should have used scissors? Still, Jaden wasn't ready to let his locks go for good. A few months later at the 2017 Met Gala, the young actor arrived on the red carpet with an unusual companion, his old dreadlocks. Jaden told Teen Vogue, since I couldn't bring my sister as a date, I brought my old hair. For now, the locks are stored in a safe place. That same year, Jaden said on The World According to Jaden Smith, the dreads are at my parents' house right now, just chilling in a glass box. However, Jaden described a few downsides of having long dreadlocks, explaining on The World According to Jaden Smith, they smelled like coconut oil and metal because I had the rings in them. So it smelled like coconut oil, metal, and bleach. And when you mix those together, it's not amazing. Jaden continued, I'm glad I have no dreads. I'm glad that I can go swimming at night and I don't have to be really cold and wake up with wet hair. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Nicki Swift videos about your favorite stuff are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.